So working from home and passive income has been a new wave in society, you know, since the pandemic. People have uh, found effective ways to work from home while making passive income, keeping a nine to five that brings more money into their pockets so they can invest, save for the future, and basically just get more money. So I wanna get into two passive side income hustles that you can do to make $500 per day. Are you ready for an easy side hustle and storage business? With Neighbor.com, you can earn passive income by renting unused space in your home, garage, or property. If you're looking for a simple way to earn passive income that does not require startup capital, you may want to look into Neighbor.com. The platform, which builds itself as the Airbnb, uh, the Airbnb of storage, per se, that actually provides an easy way for you to rent unused space in and around your home to locals needing storage space. So this is key because if you have if you have a big house or you just have space in your crib where you're just not using, utilizing it, you could be potentially making money, at least $500 a day, on that unused space for people that's needing some space to rent out. How people use neighbor.com uh, uh, vary, varies. So let me give you an example. A college student may need to be able to store a few boxes um, in a corner of somebody's crib, right? So let's say for an example, you have some space and you have a college student that wants to store their, their, their items inside your space. You could charge that college student a monthly fat rate fee to utilize that space. When you sign up to, to be a host or neighbor, you link your bank account so you can receive payments. And basically that's all you have to do in terms of the payments. So what you wanna do is you wanna go to neighbor.com, you wanna sign up as a host, and you want to fill out the, all your information and you want to at that point list your available space you got to put the square footage you got to put some detailed information in it so that and it take, obviously takes some pictures of the space uh, whether it's a garage whether it's a backyard like for an example i just redid my backyard as you can see you know it's uh really really nice um and what i'm going to do is i'm going to rent this uh, backyard space out for people who want to host events, parties, and etc. And I, I, I invested, you know, a large sum of money to redoing this backyard space. And I said, yo, what the hell? Like, I could be making some bread off this shit. So that's why I went on myself went on neighbor.com, and I'm actually charging the rent on um, this backyard space for people who want to use parties. And so far, it's been very lucrative. Lucrative. And actually, every weekend, I'm getting people. Uh, request for people who want to pay to use my backyard space so that's just more income in my pocket so I could be able to do the things I want to do and reinvest so I highly recommend neighbor.com uh, if you have unused space you could be making potentially making some bread off that so the next passive income stream uh, that you could do and work from home is setting up an Etsy online store now with Etsy online store um, you have about 90 million people who shop on Etsy.com. Like Amazon, Walmart, Etsy's a great platform. You have about 70% of consumers that are on that platform are female. And you could be making some money if you set up an online store, if you have some products to sell. So let me kind of explain and give you a breakdown of how Etsy.com works. So at this point, if you're ready to sell on Etsy, I'm gonna tell you a quick step-by-step -step guide and take you through the process um, from choosing a name for your business and how to set it up online, right? So let's start off with what is Etsy and how you can utilize having an Etsy store to make uh, passive income and you could do this from the comfort of your home. So Etsy provides realtors with everything they need uh, quickly to set up their shop and selling their products, right? One of the advantages of selling on Etsy is that everyone knows that, like I just mentioned before, there's about 90 million people who utilize uh, and are, are shoppers uh, frequently on that site, right? What, what, what this essentially means is that you already have a built-in audience for you to promote your products, right? So unlike other platforms, you already have an audience and potential customers that, that you could be selling your online products to, right? Um, the other thing too is that with Etsy, one of the things that I like is that it's committed to helping small businesses and people getting their products out to consumers that may uh, want their products. You know, they also have effective marketing tools. They also have opportunities for growth, meaning that, you know, you could obviously 
you can look at what's selling. So, 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 so this is what I want you to do, right? I want you to first do your research, you know, go to the website, kind of look at Etsy.com and see how it's structured. But I want you to research what are the top products that are selling right now. I can tell you offhand, some of the top products are uh, Calendar, Squarespace, um, Planners, um, if you have like uh, uh, decorative, like if you like like napkins and, and, and different sets like that, you know, those are some of the top things that are selling on Etsy right you know, So what I would do is I would research some of the products that are, are really selling. I would look at some of the uh, already established um, sellers that have platforms already set up. I would look at how they list their products. I would look at the price of what they charge for each one of their products. I would look at some of the reviews. And here, which I'm gonna show you in the screen is what you wanna look at is how many sales that they have so for an example let's say you have you know you created a, a, a calendar right and you you say yo i want to sell this calendar you want to look at other calendars that are selling and you want to see some of the color designs that they look at you want to see how they write up their description because seo uh, keyword description is going to be really really essential you know in this process so you want to research and look at a couple of other sellers pages to see how they design their page and you want to utilize and tailor your page that you create to what's already generate income so for example you see here that this person is already generating sales in there um, with the products that they sell and you see some of the reviews that people put that people see so utilize that information I would I would give my myself some time to study how to do this but I got an Etsy shop and I sell different products in my brand wealth and fitness lifestyles and it's helping me generate more passive income and again people are making you can make anywhere between uh, five thousand a month starting to a hundred thousand dollars, um, you know, per year, and at least paying you five hundred dollars a day just to do, you know, Etsy online store. I will say I would try Neighbor.com and Etsy uh, Etsy store. Take some time to do your research, but also too, take the initiative and look at the key is is that you want to sell products that are already being uh, sold and you just want to duplicate that process man the blueprint is already there and laid out so why not just utilize what's already there for you so that you can do that be able to potentially generate passive income on the side whether you're working uh, nine to five where you where you just work in your multiple businesses this is another business that can supplement your income where you can make investments over the time so i hope this information has helped you leave a comment down below a lot of you guys who sell space on neighbor.com or if you have an Etsy store leave a comment down below let me know how your business is doing let me know how you guys are um obviously selling your products and some of the challenges but also opportunities that you've experienced in doing this this is your boy Kurt, Wealth and Fitness Lifestyle. Leave a description down below. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you.